we couldn't do it! They said we couldn't make a real show out of 2K22! They said we wouldn't be the best damn thing on Twitch! And you know what we do two days a week? Ha <laughs> ha! We prove them wrong! Where did you go? Where have you been? Women's World Champion, Dr. Ritz Baker DMD! This one, Trish Stratus, man, she came away with a hell of a win to earn the right to face Britt for what? this. And Britt Baker! Oh, sidekick! Baker, oh no. after I clearly beat Noah Maverick in a cage match just the other night. I feel I deserve a shot at that championship. I don't like you, I don't respect you, and I don't give a damn what you and Randy Orton have been through together. And that is that Jim Cornette agrees that I deserve to be in the main event tonight. Battle lines have been drawn clearly, and that man right there doesn't look intimidated, doesn't look nervous, doesn't look scared. It looks to me like he's awful tactful, ladies and gentlemen. Is he out here by himself? Brick Grimes enjoying his vacation. Is he still wanted this match? He's still willing to come out here by himself. He's just trying to do something big. Uh-oh, walking the rope. Got it. Is he out here blowing kisses at Stacy Keebler right in front of Kenny Omega? One, two. Oh, he got him! For Kevin Dizzy, but he wraps it up with the quickness. Staying in the Reaper inside of a cage now with a pissed off Kevin Nash and a Scott Steiner hungry for a win. And Sting now battling with Nash, pulls him down, Scott Steiner, Steiner, Steiner thrown off the top by the Reaper! Ties up with him. Oh my God! They gotta decide what they wanna do. Oh my God! Power bomb as well. The Reapers gotta get up. He's gotta stop. He's gonna try to stop Scott Steiner. Steiner's out. Can he stop Nash? Nash is out. Ladies and gentlemen, the Wolfpack take a loss to the NWO in a cage. AJ Styles, representing the Four Horsemen, is here. And guys, remember, September 2nd is the date of our next Stone Dog Wrestling special show. If you've never seen one of the special shows, do not miss it. AJ trying to calm it down, it looks like. Oh, going for a handshake. Is Jay going to take it? Oh, come on! Oh, lethal! Oh! Lethal injection! It's AJ Styles and Jay Lethal in his fall! Oh, come on! Come on! Damn it! Damn it! The truth is, we were going to offer the spot of fourth horseman to Jay Lethal. Don't need you, Lethal. You needed us. But now we've moved on. So Monday night, we will make an offer to someone new who deserves the title of the fourth horseman. Nia Jax making her way to the ring and receiving quite a bit of booze from that crowd out there, ladies and gentlemen. New York, New York, Kitty Girl Dynamite! One, two, oh no! I don't know if the ref saw it! Ladies and gentlemen, do 
to the missed rope break. The match is being restarted. We're gonna oh no, Naya, Naya, Naya! Oh my God, come on! I don't even know how this is continuing. Dinah, come on, Naya, don't! Naya, damn it! in the house tonight. Taking home the upset win here, believe it or not. Over one red hot kitty girl dynamite. We're gonna make sure the next time you two get in the ring, the odds are a little bit more even. Television championship on the line. Edge versus the T. Let's go! Edge in the house! Now, taking that TV title off CM Punk, the T's been out here making his own legacy. He may not be able to take a whole lot of these submissions from the T. But Ed, Spear! Spear! One! Is that it? Oh my God, Ed just won the TV title! Half the crowd stunned, half loving it. I tell you what, guys, I couldn't think of anybody better to represent us than this pair. Right here, I'm talking about Callie Cummings and my buddy, Outlaw Epps, pairing up for the first time to take on the NWO. And China, China cannot stand Cummings. These two have been rivals from the very start. And now, but Callie has decisively won that rivalry. Hanging him off the top and now, pounds him down. More of those sick. blows to the head happen. Rolls him up. German goes for the pin. Quote, too busy to stop by the SDW Media Center for this interview, says Burke. Got three words for all of you asshole. Come on, who cheered when the Reaper knocked me out, he says. Unsafe work environment. I don't know who the hell you think you are, but you do not get to order me into a matchup with anyone. Of course, he's talking. You also do not get to bend rules so that members of our talent roster aren't able to walk away from a match which you did just the other night. This is where Cornette turned that match between the Wolfpack and NWO into an extreme rules match. And of course, if you guys missed that, this was last week and you guys can watch the recaps. Exclamation YT will get you a link to my YouTube channel. I upload a video weekly. If you guys watch that whole video for me, like and comment, that can really help this channel grow. I'd really appreciate it, but it'll also keep you up to date on everything going on. And yeah, last week Sting took advantage of the extreme rules match. Scott Hall fell to the wayside. It's a casualty. Scott Hall is injured for the foreseeable future thanks to your management, Jim. From Louisville, Kentucky. With Burton. What's... Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Okay, so... That's right, Burton. You're on my show. And that means you don't speak unless I let you, says Cornette. I no more have to answer to you than I'm obligated to throw your mother a towel when I'm done with- Oh, come on, Jim! a few months ago, and you may have failed to notice that I absolutely can put you in a match. You are talent. I am management. And if you touch me, you get suspended without pay. Thank you! I don't need to explain anything to you, but you need to get ready because since you decided to drop by the arena tonight, I took the opportunity to book you in a little warm-up match for SD... What? You how we deal with NWO sympathizers here. Oh, my God. But, of course, if your paycheck to provide your family isn't important to you, feel free to walk away now. What kind of ring gear you brought with you under the jeans and suit jacket? Oh, my God in heaven. No, we are not setting him loose on him. No. No, my God. And his opponent... Representing the Ministry of Darkness from Houston, Texas. Weighing in at 281 pounds, Dr. Grizz. Boxers here.
triple threat steel cage match and is for the extreme fighting championship his eyes on the prize inserting himself into this matchup by and right introducing the challengers he is the extreme fighting champion the prodigy noah maverick up with Kenny Omega for the world title tonight. Keith Lee has made an open challenge the past few days. We're going to go ahead and we're not going to give MJF any attention. I can tell you this though. Cut the damn music. Bitch. I don't care who the hell you think you are. You will not be doing this anymore tonight. You are banned from the building for the rest of the night, MJF. The United States Wrestling Championship. Oh my God! Freaking Cassidy! Tip it up! Mr. Limitless himself! Keith Lee! Ow! Foot to the face and Orange Cassidy here. He's, oh my God, guys, this is focused. This is as focused as we've ever seen this man. One, two, no! Oh! What? 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 United States. just cost Keith Lee the title. He's the co-founder of the NWO, one of the co-founders, a former general manager in WWE, TNA, and WCW, and also here. And also, he wears a women's size six shoe. People get hurt, and the rules are stacked unfairly on Fridays. Tonight should be no different, right? Well, Jim Cornette, if you're making unfair matches and deciding when rope breaks are called, I can absolutely do the same, and it starts tonight when Sting is in a handicap match against Kevin Nash and Hollywood Hogan, says Bischoff. And don't worry, Stone Dog, you'll get some action tonight as well when you and Outlaw Epps face Andre Six and Scott Steiner. The Come on, the Reaper, Jay Lethal, Tommy End. 
have all been banned from the arena tonight for the remainder of the show, or they will be handed a 90-day suspension, says Bischoff. So good luck finding anyone to help you even out those numbers later tonight, boys. Andre's here and he's angry. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the NWO World Championship. Ladies and gentlemen, Alliance. Oh, God damn it. Sebastian, you didn't tell me this. Did you put the DI out there for him to plug into? And as the man who holds the power of the wind in his fist, I've got one question for everybody here tonight. Who wants to walk with Elias? Ladies and gentlemen, representing the NWO, it's their world champion, Sammy Rose. But Sammy Rose, now that that's happened, Rose might be done talking. Ah, oh, what a... Goes Rose in the right hands. Launching. And he go... Uh oh what is this? I've never... Is he gonna... Go, oh, my God! Outsider's Edge! Outsider's Edge! Oh, come on, Rose! Samuel. No! That is a $5,000 fine, you ass! What the hell was that? Get him the hell out of the ring! What a disrespectful little prick! And Harlem Heat on the way to the ring, and you can see that Spark Championship around the waist of Naomi. Oh, busted! We got the women's world tag team champions in the house. Let's go! Wait, now Cummings, the right hand. Oh, right here. One, no, two, the rope break. Oh, no rope break. Colin Kelly Cummings. Ladies and gentlemen, Sting may his way to the ring. Down, nice pile driver there. Stink. Gets him up. Off the turnbuckle. Throws him in. Hogan. Hogan is caught. Will he tap? Go for a tag here to Nash. Oh no, he's just beating the hell out of him still. Look at this violence from Hogan. Wait until the last second to stop Hogan, but Hogan, Hogan, oh my God. Hogan just turned into an animal. One, two, is that it? That is it, oh my God. The Usos in the house tonight after just joining the Syndicate. Also, the New Age Outlaws are here. And the ministry, the remnants of the ministry are here as well. Face of Uso, Adam Page locking up, and Braddock, the clothesline there from Brett. One, two, oh, Braddock dies! Classic Jake Roberts style clothesline on Jimmy Uso, and after all the beating that he took, he gets the win in the New Age Outlaws steal one here. All kinds of action all over the ring, but right there it was. Look at that, the contact. And Bane Raddick gets the win. And in the game, give it up for KGD! Jax, there's no punches pulled in that category. Everybody booing as soon as she shows up here. break, there's no escape in the cage. That's the rules of the extreme fighting match. And delivers and a right hand. Now she's tying up here with KGD again. Up and down she goes. Taking her to the cage here. Eight minutes left in this matchup, guys. To the rope she goes and the cage rattles and done it. Oh! On the top rope of the... Trying to get it, kid. Uh oh. Oh! She's got it! Oh! She, oh my god, she broke her arm! Oh, it snaps the 
freaking arm of Kaya! Matt and Nick Jackson head to the ring. And guys, if you missed it, in Britt Grimes' absence just the other night, we did see Kevin Dizzy come out to the ring and get a singles win over Nick Jackson. For the bits. And guys, they get, they get some love, they get some hate. But regardless, they, they show up, they do the work. At least two of them do. We watch the tag team champs head to the ring. Dizzy off the top. Oh! Dizzy, my God. Oh! Kicks him in the stomach and takes him down. Off the top rope. Oh, my God! Sales! Vaughn using the ropes, too! Oh, my God! The box! The box! Look at this. Lands it, but look, using the bottom rope. Look at him use that leverage. Look at that. Missed by the rope. Damn it! you think you're up to tonight or what is going on with this referee this is getting a little bit damn suspicious at this point let us know what you think guys who should get the title shot for the spark title against naomi again you have five minutes there going forward bischoff has said the rules have changed said that we drew blood first and what's that mean well we're getting a glimpse of it right now Andre. don't forget he beat Noah Maverick, 11 wins, I think 12 wins to three in an Iron Man match. He is no joke. The bigger they are, the harder they fall. We gonna find out tonight. Nightmare! Stone Dog in the house, baby! Ladies and gentlemen, we've got somebody that has stepped up that's volunteered to help out tonight. Let's go! You know, we said we had to go through hell to earn his respect and Rob Van Dam showing that Stone Dog might have done just that! I've been watching, says Flip. What? Stone Dog, I gave you my blessing last year when you reformed the Horsemen to fight off the NWO. A little bit... You have no reason to be loyal to Jay Stone Dog. What has he done for you? When has he had your back? Haven't you always had his? I know you're getting tired of being ganged up on by the NWO like you were earlier tonight. 
I want you to take the next few days to decide, and I'd like your answer by Friday night, Stone Dog. Jay Lethal's Wrestling Academy, the Lethal Academy in the house, ladies and gentlemen. And that's right, it is time to get down on this right now. I'm talking about a world title matchup here. Shinsuke Nakamura taking on Kenny Omega. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the undisputed World Wrestling Championship. Let's go, Wolfie, it's time! Shinsuke Nakamura coming out at the end of Mavericks matchup just the other night, probably making him just a little bit nervous. But Nakamura not going for the Extreme Fighting Championship. Oh, no, no, no. This man had his sights set on the World Heavyweight title, letting Omega know ahead of time that he would face him here tonight. But that cost him. If you guys missed it, at the beginning of this show, MJF brutally attacked Shinsuke Nakamura backstage with a damn shovel. Ladies and gentlemen, the Stone Dog Wrestling Undisputed World Heavyweight Champion, Kenny Omega! Nakamura, it's good to have him back, but the last time we saw him, he represented the NWO. Now, he's shown no signs of that this time. Bomb and Omega up top. Oh, my God. Oh, this matchup and Omega knows it. Damn it. Of what's scheduled to be a rematch with Jay Leo. Full Nelson suplex one. 